March 5th, 2021. Another day, another wrestling death. That's the way 2021 seems to be going. Uh, I wasn't prepared to do a video today. I was going to watch SmackDown, maybe a movie. And I started getting calls from people. Did you hear that Buddy Colt died? He was in his 80s. An iconic wrestler. Great guy. Um, I remember seeing him very often when he, um, in the days when he shared the broadcast desk with uh, Gordon Soley and Bob Le Barbara Clary in uh, Championship Wrestling from Florida. I was down there every few months, <clears throat> had dinner with Buddy and Gordon several times, telling wrestling stories. Uh, the first time I ever saw Buddy Colt in person, because I used to see him in the magazines, of course. Um, let me back up. The first time I'd ever seen him was on TV, either at Washington, D.C. or Bridgeport, Connecticut, on the old... Uh, uh, Vince McMahon Sr. shows. Uh, he was under his name, Ron Reed, Cowboy Ron Reed. And he was a decent, really decent competitor. But uh, the first time I really got to see him in person was probably early 1971. I was on a trip in Atlanta covering the matches at the City Auditorium. And uh, I met Buddy that night backstage. He was terrific to me, posed for pictures, and that night he wrestled a um, lights out uh, taped fist match against uh, Big Bad John. And it was one of the bloodiest encounters I had ever photographed, even though I was new at photographing at ringside, it was pretty much at, toward the start of my career. Uh, but. Uh, Buddy was one of those guys that the fans loved to hate, and he was really good at what, at what he did. Um, he wrestled just about in every territory, yeah, and he was a star in so many territories. I remember seeing him in the uh, <clears throat> mid-southern area, Nashville, Memphis. And of course, uh, he was always attached through his life um, about piloting the plane back in uh, Tampa in the early uh, 70s um, that crashed and among the um, the people on that plane were Gary Hart, um, Mike McCord who became Austin Idol, Johnny Valentine and Bobby Shane who perished uh, in that plane crash. Um, Buddy was uh, a classic style bad guy. He knew how to wrestle. He knew how to be that bad guy in the ring to make the fans react to him. But after all of this, and from his days in Florida when he became a broadcaster and all that, uh, fans started to really love him. And he was a really sweet guy. He kept in touch with a lot of us on uh, on Facebook, and uh, they're going to miss you, Buddy Colt, big part of pro wrestling history. Your Buddy Colt memories, please uh, leave them right here. This is Bill Apter at the Apter Chat, um, onewrestlingvideo.com, and I hope I don't have to do another one of these. Uh, I mean, I'm it's becoming almost routine. I hate this. I really do. Hope I don't have to do another one of these for ages. <sighs> That's it. Please leave your uh, thoughts about uh, Buddy Colt uh, right here on uh, uh, on YouTube, OneWrestlingVideo.com. Thanks.